What's up, y'all? Welcome to another episode of the Rogo Bros. I am Ed. He is Dave. And today, we're doing Jujutsu Kaisen, episode 18. Episode 18, we out here. We out here bobbing and weaving. Out here putting the hands on you. Like Maki did the Maki. Oh boy. Oh boy. That was an ass whooping. That was an, that's the ass whooping that your, that your older sibling is supposed to put on you, really. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's supposed that. supposed to happen. That's what's supposed to happen. That's what. Yeah, so you remember how it go. You remember the hierarchy. That's. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, this is effectively Yuruichi and Soy Fong. I mean, if they were sisters. Because well, there's no real explanation on why that is the way it is, but it is what it is. Because so. <laughs> I never understood it. I was like, why are you mad? Because she left. It's always because they leave, though, isn't it? It is. Why you leave me with these motherfuckers like that? You know I don't like these motherfuckers. They'd be like, be like, damn, soy fire. Like we just, we just celebrated your birthday you yesterday. Give a fuck about none of y'all. Check this, bitch, bro. <laughs> it's like, damn, damn, soy fire. Why you do that? Why can't you do that to no hollows though? But that's a, that's a, that's a conversation for another day. <laughs> and, I mean. He not wrong though, but but that's not the case here. I mean, listen. Even though Maki gave my that word, my is not the one to be fucked with when she out there. Because if it was my my versus Nabara, I find that more fair. I find that more fair. Nabara to my brother's point last week. He said best in the helmet because I think that's the second time she got, <laughs> she's got popped in the head or had, yeah. a, had a gun in her head or to her face, like. And she ain't really had no protection. It's like you might want to learn how to count, counter with these hammers on um, uh, Durarara. If you ain't check that out on Netflix, check that out. Or if you haven't read it, read it. Dope shit. The motherfucker with the hammer, my favorite motherfucker in there. <laughs> he goes hard out here with the motherfucking forces on. Legit. <laughs> I mean, um, any, anybody, anytime you got some clean footwork and in, in anime, you gonna be you gonna be legit. Nah, definitely check. Definitely check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Durarara. It's the one with the dude with the dinosaur head. Anyway, I'm getting off topic here. We're about to get up into this episode because it's about to be Fushiguro versus this other guy from another head clan, which we should see some dope fighting from Fushiguro for once. See something that we ain't seen before. Maybe see the potential that motherfuckers like Sukuna is invested in for this motherfucker and why he should be the head of the Zen clan like Neji. Show me something. Show me something. Don't, don't, don't pull a Neji. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> yeah, don't do that. But I got faith in him. Yeah, he started yeah. right in the middle yeah. of that shit. Damn. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Which girl is good at getting the fuck out of there? Yeah. Then what they push girl is gonna do? I mean, but, but he's posed up nice though. Like, yeah. not gonna lie. No, if you and then we just, just he's like, oh damn, and they follow you. No, that's that's legit. Damn, just who? Oh, you say don't play me. Oh, get the fuck off here. You can ignore physics, yeah, bro. That shit's crazy. Losing your voice. Damn, he out here running other tasks on you, son. No, also these tonfas is is sick. Anybody who fucks with some tapas is a, I fucks with you. Blood manipulation? That's never a good sign, bro. It's never a good sign. <laughs> Ten shadows. Oh, wow. I mean, if only, but if that's only. not the case. That's not the way. That's <laughs> not the case. It's that ain't me. It it's me. Oh, damn! With the, I'm willing to get in there with the hands! hands. I'm willing to get in there and hands! Oh. Nah. His hand was striking, boy. Yes. Oh. Yes. oh shit! What the fuck? Oh! Ooh, damn! Fourth ball, bitch. Nah. <laughs> damn! 
that nigga is clean. Please give me give me some chakra points. Give me some chakra yeah. points. Damn. He's pulling Luffy shit, bro. This is some Luffy shit. Second? <laughs> nah, that's fucking hacks. Yeah. That's uh, like a uh, Oma from uh, Kenga Ashura. They both kind of have a similar technique of like, kind of like doping with like their 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 blood cells. Like I know that like Oma, the main character, he from, came, from Kenga Ashura. Uh, no, you know you're right. You're right. Like the, I don't remember his name, but like no, he definitely. Yeah, be, yeah. Uh, Oma, uh, I can't remember his first name. He be on some unlocking some uh, shit that he shouldn't be unlocking. It. Hell no, nah, he should not be unlocking like, it. It fucks with because he's degrading his sales or some shit. Like so, yes, yeah, it's, it's to the same degree. That's why I said like with that with that Luffy shit is like yeah, you know, is it? Yeah, no, you're right. Shit up. Like I mean, technically they, I don't think they gonna say that, but I think that that's low key dope. But he no, it is because he's step. he's forced because he you yeah, know Luffy legitimately forces the his blood he forces like his blood to pump like more through his body since all of his blood vessels is also rubber, so he can do that shit. So yes, and because he can manipulate blood, how he sees fit, he can do the same thing Luffy does, and then add more shit on there. Just to be like, yeah, I'm gonna be <laughs> Sage. She's still out here. Damn. Like, I got body. She's still body. took my sword. Damn. Got body. Damn. Took my sword. Got body. <laughs> how will I tell anybody about this? Damn, you even in this? Damn. Why you ain't got two just, swords? What's up? Yeah, bro? you should have you should have carried a couple another sword. Three swords die, oh boy, come on. At least a knife. Useless me one here. Damn. Damn. Caught you slipping! He's making the move! He's making the move! Hello? Sleep. Just come come in and if come in and clean up. Be quiet and go to sleep. Go to sleep. <laughs> oh. Damn. Damn. What is Evil. that? Evil is in There's the forest. Bloodlust. Don't make me. Don't make me lose my mind. <laughs> you oh, rat shit. bastards. Damn. I mean, it's not. That's not. This. You sure this. about that? You sure about that, you old bastard? This guy. That sounds like a big motherfucker. Hold on, brother. Yeah. That's not. Oh what damn. I... Oh. Chill out, bro. No. Oh shit. Oh okay. what? Okay, cool. Wait a minute. Who killed it? Uh. Oh and shit. And that may be. Who even is more... that? That's, That's one of the motherfuckers that was with Mahito. How we get in there? Yeah. Oh my. Oh, oh, he, oh he talks backwards. Oh, ah, yeah. uh, he's oh, talking fuck backwards. This nigga, this nigga. Oh, who's this nigga behind him? With the nah, he. Cobra. He, Jesus. Jesus. You talking real big? He got other messed up. Talking real big, him. nigga. I mean, that's my toe with him though. So maybe he can. <laughs> Make Gojo into a coat rack. Oh no. no. <laughs> Stop! Damn! Dang it! Dope. I like to set it first yeah. off, just throwing hands in the yeah, martial art room. Yeah. Come on, hallway, boy. No, they, no the hallway. their fighting scenes are so fucking good. Yes. Oh, mm. footwork, good footwork, right there. Oh, with that, oh, broke through the next one. Well, he got a plan. Come on, Fushi girl. Shadow style his ass. And I don't need this. Yes, they are. Everybody can't throw hands. And nobody, everybody ain't really, really willing to throw hands like that. I'm going to be with him. Damn, I order, not you rap it. You're talking big like I want to whoop that ass. Real big. He ain't even phased. You a lot. <laughs> I mean, not a lot. This dude looks dope as fuck. He do. Wow. Damn. I ain't here to Damn. talk about that shit. I ain't here to talk about that. Ain't I ain't part of that shit no more. I'm just, I'm just here. I don't give a fuck. Right? Wrong means nothing. Yeah, I will do what Let's I want to do. Get out of here. Yeah! 
That's what I'm talking about. That's why you just my best friend. Yes! We share the same idea. Let's do it. Come on! That damn frog came out. No, of that frog. Right? That frog yeah. is that frog is dope. Oh, this is a distraction, bitch. Catch his work. Woo! Max Elephant! Take this master on! No! Master on! <laughs> It's morphin' time, nigga, but... <laughs> nigga, nah, if you want to. GG, oh, this, oh change. my yeah, god, it's beautiful. Yeah, no, yeah, that shit's yeah. dope. Yes, they are. Yep. I'm on you. I'm on you. Let's go. Let's go. Do it. Yeah, do it. Do it. Get his ass. Oh, I like that perspective. Oh, yes. Boy, you lit up. One more time. Oh, One more time. Love it. GG. Oh no! No, that's clean. No, that yeah, is clean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo, your girl said I'm on it, boy. He's still coming. Whoa. Whoa. Nani? That is fucking no. massive. First Hokage out here. Yeah, wood style Jesus. Damn. I mean, he was out here doing his damnness, bro. Ooh, he hey, was. Oh shit. He's like. <laughs> They dispatched that very easily. Yeah, they did. Now your plan's like, I'm old. Uh, what are you about to do? This yeah. nigga, no, nah, isn't it? Tagura don't got upset. I'm gonna have to hit 80 <laughs> percent. He do look like Tagura. Give me that money. I want the money. Come on, old man. Let's go. They about to just hustle over there fast as fuck, boy. I guess not. The <laughs> Gojo's gonna take his time. Even though he could be there like now. Yeah. What? Oh, oh shit, hell. nah, that's. Oh yeah. Hashirama out here. Just yeah, do the fucking just work. fucking niggas up. <laughs> what? That doesn't seem good. Is that? That doesn't seem good at all. You uh, like he's putting up a fucking area. Yeah. Uh, a strong one, it seems, because it's not. Good. That's like a Hado. I'm assuming that spike just made it like uh, a lot harder. Uh, to... Gojo, get in there, bro. Get in there, Gojo. Is that a double? Double thing? A double thing? Oh, yeah. Yeah. oh you shit. get the fuck out of there, yeah. right? Yeah. She oh, should probably get over. No, no, yeah. no. You still out your pants outside. It's not wrong, bro. Yeah, that's Gojo, not good. Gojo, you could have got in there. He could have. He, Gojo said. Yeah, no, they're impressive. <laughs> Oh, uh, that's not what I was expecting. <laughs> oh, no. What? Everybody else is coming this bitch except for Gojo? Oh, hell. Damn. They said, they said we'll let anybody else come in this bitch that's except fair. your ass. We'll scrap with anybody else you got except him. <laughs> we keeping that nigga away. He can't come in here. He got a suitcase, bro. Hold on, bro. What's what is he doing? What, what's in that suitcase? I mean, you should assume that based off the bill. Yeah. Keep it going. Why would they just? Why would they just do that? Didn't you put up the barrier? Okay, that explains that. Dude. All you care about doing that shit now, but you was trying to kill Yuji. This old man about to be scrapping? I mean, like anytime an old dude wants to scrap, he's usually fine. Is he just the old rocker? No, he's out here looking like a bat. That's <laughs> Loki. Yeah. It's yeah. like, no, bro, I'm about to hold you with the sounds of music. <laughs> Nigga, Led Zeppelin to this bitch. <laughs> you know what he's saying? He's like, making a whole fucking phone call in front of you. Yeah, him. they're like, yeah, yeah like, you, like you got time. <laughs> we ain't asking. Don't move. Oh, uh, they're gonna that work is? on him. Oh, okay. Oh, here's a blood power. power. We out here whooping that. Ass. Oh, was that a shuriken? Yeah. These no, are three main families, by the way. Just, just <laughs> teaming up on them. Just. <laughs> I didn't even know that. Oh shit! New way. Damn, he got the stash. <laughs> Okay. Did that do anything? No. No, not at all. I mean, not at all. GG Fushi girl for not running away like he did with the uh, <laughs> semi-green. Ain't no running. Ain't no running right now. Yeah, I guess, yeah, no. 
Did you already sword? Nah, that sword looks dumb as fuck. Damn. Dude, dude, get him out of here. <laughs> so, effectively, from what I gather, Mother Earth has said, fuck you. It's like, I'm tired of y'all. I'm tired of your pollution. I'm tired of your bullshit. I'm tired of y'all motherfuckers taking up the space. I'm tired of y'all cutting down these trees and forests. Making these forests terrible. Have nothing. Taking away their hopes. Even after motherfuckers wished it back after Tree of Might and it was burned down. <laughs> burned down. <laughs> Doesn't matter what it is. It, 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 like, it's, it's real. It's just like. Was, we, was, we was going on, moving smooth. Then you humans came in with your pollution and shit, just deforestation, habitat loss, and then just more shit, more shit, more shit on top of it. If we talking about like curses and how strong they are based off of like how much negative energy is in there, I mean, I'm pretty sure there's a lot of negative energy coming out, <laughs> out of Mother Earth out here being the best Hashirama she can be. Yeah, she's pissed. Absolutely. Come in and made her own language. Like, I don't even want to communicate with you rat bastards. All right? I don't even want to talk your same language. <laughs> you talk my language. You listen to me. <laughs> you listen to what I say. <laughs> you, breathe, you, I was here before you. You breathe in my air. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming to collect, nigga. Yeah, yeah. Your time is up. <laughs> my time is now. <laughs> you can't see me. My time is now. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> no, what is this that madness? What? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that's too far. <laughs> Stop. What am I witnessing? <laughs> what is this going is on? This is crazy. Looking like a beetle. But she loves the planet. Peacefully. Was there a hole in her hand? There was. Get. What? All the way. The fuck. Out of here. <laughs> Stop. Okay, so she Ooh, releases the air by the Okay, hey, you man, get. Oh, that fizz! Well, I can't wait till next the next episode. episode. Five. Next episode gonna be lit. Not to say this episode wasn't lit. Like, was it as action-packed as the last one? No, but it was setting up for this episode, which I appreciate. But it also established that these three head hold, uh main family households, what pretty much their niche is. Because I asked that the last time. What's the niche of the Zenin clan? And whatnot. So you got the blood manipulation, pretty much, the, I guess, something in there as far as manipulating stuff. So, <laughs> like, you manipulate, so either you're manipulating blood, like um, Kamo and his clan, you're, you're manipulating Shikigami, like the Zenins. Or your, or like these, like Inumaki, like wherever he come from. They, they manipulate spell words. Casters. So they manipulate words. So, so, so the Inumaki clan, they're like a clan of spellcasters or whatever. So, like, that's that's all I know as far as far as I know. So, like, to your point, yeah, they manip. Well, is it word manipulation or using the power or cursing curses in words? Because I know Inumakis, but is that everybody's in the Inumaki clan? If that's a, the clan, unless I, Inumaki is the first name and not the last name, not sure, but. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. But from uh, from what we're seeing with Inumaki, it definitely seems like he, like, yeah, it might be the curse within it, but, like, he's still, like, his words carry weight and power. So he has to be careful in what he says. So I feel like that is, like, manipulating words. And, and like, the words that he's choosing to use to the reverberate or whatever because like when he told him to run away like that like he told him to run away they felt that but I don't was that did that compel them to run away or did they run away of their own fruition because it seemed like they ran away of their own fruition because when he told um, the cursed spirit or mother earth to don't move she just didn't move you know what I'm saying so it's like 
what what was was it intent? Because they still showed his power working, even though he was telling them to run away. So I would have figured it made it would have made him like be on some cold Gia shit where they yeah, don't just continue to run. But I guess like they, I guess like maybe intent. That, that's why I say I think intent matters. It's like he has to be very careful to not say some shit like oh run because you might be running forever. But like in the sense, it's just like okay, there's danger. Go ahead and run. I think that it's a little bit of both. I think that they saw the danger and then they ran. But I think that like his words compelled them to run. It's just like oh, this nigga's telling us to run. Well, fuck. Like even before I've already started running, I'm like 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 thinking about it. I'm running and I'm like okay, we gotta get away from this fucking I danger. I don't think that's good enough credit for the 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 importance of knowing how dangerous your simple words can even be just based off the fact that like even when he's caught in the moment he still has to be aware of what he's saying and where he's saying it because even if he's directing it to this person I, if, I think if there's another person in that vicinity who just so happens to hear it they also get affected by that so if he's like he's like Erase, and like your friends are there, and you was aiming for this curse, nigga. He just erased all of it. <laughs> all of everybody who heard it, as far as it, it, from my understanding. You know and I'm saying, it's like, what was his what was his domain expansion look like, nigga? At this point, you just, I'm just in your head, like mentally. At this point, nigga, it don't even matter. <laughs> yeah, I I think it's gonna be it, 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 like. Okay, now I can compel you to do whatever I want. It's almost like some Harry Potter shit, the Imperious Curse, where you can like you use that shit and like you can you can control and manipulate somebody, and they don't even really they're aware of it, but like it doesn't fucking matter. Like they're gonna do whatever the fuck you want them to do. So like it's kind of like it's kind of like that. Like they do like to your point, they do do a very good job of like showing how important those words are because it's just like this nigga really can only nigga I can I can say food I can say food like that's all I can do to convey my emotions in my <laughs> in my state of being because if I say anything else I might fuck something up so like following along on the the head family clans or whatever it's like like Fushiguro so they call it like Ten Shadow Technique or manipulation. Ten, ten shadows. Ending. So apparently there's ten shadows. Is that the limit? Because that doesn't seem like it would be the limit uh, based off of like what we've seen people's abilities being. So like even though it's these ten shadows, is it just those are your limits of shadows you can use? Like he said, I tamed this one. Does that mean that you're actively going out and capturing these shadows and doing battle with them? Or are these something that you inherently already have in your inventory and you just can't unlock them until you get to a certain level? Or, or like, how do you go about taming these things? Do you have to physically fucking fight them? And for, it's like, all right, I got this one shadow in here. His name's uh, Trevor. I bring him out and it's like, hey, this is round, This is the, the 50th time that we've gone at this, Trevor. It's just me and you battling this 50 cuz. All right, I ain't, I ain't win this boss battle. And then he gets back in there and... You just keep your XP points and lose them on some, I don't know, Bloodborne shit or, <laughs> or something like that. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, like, I, I think it's, I think it's something, I think it's something to that, to that point because I thought that there was something mentioned about like anytime, even if his cursed spirit gets destroyed, like other, like that power goes to his other cursed spirits, so like that, and therefore can make them stronger. So I think that maybe like. If some things have been destroyed, like maybe that there's another cursed spirit that's able to come along that's like now more powerful based on the fact that the other ones were destroyed. Well, what is actually the destruction of it? Because like I think I saw Nue, the bird one. I think I seen him get like wrapped up by the blood manipulation dude, and then come back to attack the. He probably released the technique. But that's what I'm saying. So like. What what does that actually look like? You killing a shadow because is it permanently dead, or does it just go back to the shadow realm, cast out? You get off. 
I want to say that they talked about it. Realm, I want to say that they talked about it through <laughs> the also that was funny. But I think I think that, that like they talked about it in earlier episodes, but I can't really remember. And maybe some guys in the comments or girl, uh, or or ladies in the comments can can uh, enlighten us on that. Um, but you know, I the way I think of it, or the way I think that it is, is that. Uh, those weaker cursed spirit if they get if those shigami if they get destroyed they go back and then like their the that to those the experiences are transferred to like something else or like when it is brought back it's more stronger uh, well and that's another thing it's like what what would determine the strength output of these 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 shadow curses like well, okay i think it just depends it's, on what you use it for it's like he uses the frogs for close quarter combat or like to kind of like or for defense but then he uses new way for our offense or uses the elephant for offense well, what's what i'm saying okay so like let's take new way new way has like electricity if if all this nigga shadows was exhausted and this nigga had new way would new way's attack be able to overcome a fucking special raid curse spirit you know what I'm saying? And as far as attack power. You know what I'm saying? Because we clearly see that he doesn't have the attack power to do anything with the, the Mother Earth uh, curse spear. So it's like... And so I guess I, to your point is, I, I guess are you saying like, you know, what what determines the strength output of something? And then it's also like, okay, does he have the firepower? Will he eventually be able to get that firepower as he continues to learn this technique and, and starts to master it. Right. It's like, you know, do you, do you know what's at your disposal? Well, I haven't tamed this one yet. So I'm like, okay, you haven't tamed this one to what? Shoot out water out of its nose? <laughs> no, yeah, I don't know. Like, I guess, I don't know. Maybe there's like because some Because the, the way, he, like, yeah, it was dope how he summoned it. And what he did, it, it, it's like all these shadow things have... It's like the Pokemon trainer on Super Smash Bros. It's like when you pick your poison. What do you want to do here? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You can get Squirtle. You can get Ivy Sword. You can get Charizard, nigga. What you want? I got you. Use them together in, in, in contrast or whatever. You can release multiple ones. And so I guess the, the, the effective, effectiveness lies in the fact of how many you can release at once. So when uh, the dude with the blood manipulation was like, I didn't know you could release more than one. And these motherfuckers at a time. So if you just wanted to have your whole squad out here, you could. You know what I'm saying? And I guess it like it, it makes you keep yourself on your toes because the way it seems is I'm not sure where they where they're summoned from. So it's like how far is the distance in which as he's applying the technique, how far away can that can this shadow uh, soldier or shadow creature be summoned? Like, is, does it have to be right in front or next to Fushiguro? Or can it be, like, right in front of the enemy if this nigga wanted to just summon him? Because the way that frog was just chilling in the room, it was a hallway. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, they're scrapping in the hallway. And as far as I remember, like, all the frogs and shit that they had fought was, like, somewhere else. It wasn't in no room. So then you're like, how the fuck did this frog in the room and no doors are open? I'm trying to figure that out. So I don't understand. I mean, maybe may, not understand, but I, 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 I think that's interesting questions to answer or ask about Fushiguro's power, which I think leads into the, 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 the point of why Fushiguro and, or why Sakuna and other individuals are interested in Fushiguro because of the amount of questions that we even had concerning this motherfucker's powers. So the blood manipulation guy, I, I guess we'll speak briefly on him. That's mm -hmm. like, as far as I can tell, he just literally just manipulates his own blood. It, whether it's in his body or outside of his body, he manipulates his own blood. I'm, and I guess he, I mean, he's doping. I guess it's, he's just enhancing his, his, his overall performance. But his curse technique just also with these arrows. So, like, I don't think arrows are his curse technique. But, but like, I think by putting blood on the arrows, it's... Yeah, <laughs> it doesn't yeah. 
He uh, it says he can manipulate the blood. Since he put the he puts the blood on the arrow, and that's how he can control where it goes. Yeah, so because it's like he said it was like Fushiguro was like it's breaking physics and it was bending corners and shit. So it's like it's like homing missiles. Pretty and, much, you know, it, uh, like. You would think like, oh, this guy's eyes are just closed for fucking like, you know, design. No, no, he clearly opens his eyes and he's clearly shooting. He's shooting and fighting with his eyes closed. But <laughs> this is what he's doing. Yeah. Like, and he's only got, for whatever reason, I think the, the idea of him only having one eye open is uh, pretty much saying that how much of his, of his power that he's using as far as the doping. Because I believe if both eyes were open, the amount uh, or power that he'd be exerting would be massive. But I don't think his body currently can take that, personally. So it's like, uh, if, if, if your eyes are the indicator of how much power he's using, or whether it be, like, you know, what's going on with, as far as, like, with his, uh, the color of it, it's called red scales. And the only thing I saw was his eye. But if your whole body goes, look, starts looking like Mike Guy when he opens the eighth gate. You know what I'm saying? That's completely different. Actually, that might be the basis in which I start looking at that as a form of, nigga, that's what that, that looks like when, when, you, when you release full power. And you pretty much rock me. Because you can pretty much just take some of these characters and equate them to other motherfucking characters quite easily, really. I mean, no, you can't. That's the beauty of this thing. That's the beauty of this anime shit is to is to compare and contrast with other with with other anime. And like Jujutsu Kaisen, so far has done a really good job of like kind of setting up everybody's powers and like kind of making them different. Like I think of the guy with his like it's like okay, I can make I need one eye good, but it's like I'm still manipulating the blood in my body. I only have a fixed amount of blood at a certain amount of time, so it's like maybe only one eye for for a balance effect okay let me get one eye good now i know i can see whatever i need to fucking see and i can react accordingly but then I, like the rest of my limbs are also like i can use and be okay with because it's like if you, you put too much in one area to dope one area out like are are you balanced enough to be able to like really point. keep fighting yeah that's a good point because you you so out of it it's like right it's you just in berserk now. Yeah, no, it's like it's like that Sasuke shit. It's just like, okay, yeah, you can see, you can see what Rock Lee doing, but <laughs> <laughs> it's like, and you do. It's okay. Come on. He jumped. He jumped up here before. Okay. Why you gotta take over, Nico? We trying to end the video. Who? Alright. <laughs> <laughs> we tried it in the video, Nico. Alright, listen. Alright, well. Clearly, he wants some attention. So. Hey, but we got some. There's some homework this week. Thinking about these motherfuckers' powers. And, 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 and how they work. How they work. Because, like, delving into, like, the fact that we have this many questions about the world means that they're doing a damn good job of introducing everybody's powers and introducing everybody's techniques and knowing that like any given Sunday somebody can get that work based off of the uh, uh, you know the rules of how this shit works so um, if you guys watched this far thank you please don't forget to like share and subscribe follow us on all platforms at Roco Bros Hey. And and don't y'all forget, Nico included, we are all bros at the Roco Bros. And until next time, peace. peace.